I'm so happy to see you, Shama. It's so good to have you here. And today, I have a few skincare products I've been loving lately. And yeah, I thought of showing these things to you. And these are quite good. Let's start then. So first, I have this one. This uh, toner. I see two toners. The first one I have is from Benton. They're green tea toner. So I love this one. This is hydrating. This is very soothing. I liked this toner from Isn't Tree Green Tea which I still love but this one is also very good and honestly for my skin I think this is working better for now though I tried uh, a serum from the same line from Benton but I didn't like that much didn't do much for my skin for that I would prefer Isn't Tree Green Tea uh, serum but for toner I think this is really good really awesome this is hydrating this is soothing and summer is coming you need something that can soothe your skin well that can give you this glow that can calm down your skin because the heat is too much and there it does a very good job and it has good ingredients like green tea with that it also has centella it has magwort extract these are known to soothe the skin it also has emectants like glycerin it has little amount of willow bark extract it actually has 50 percent of a green tea water so the formulation is a bit less concentrated than uh, the isn't tree green tea toner to be very honest so if you want more of green tea then go for isn't tree but yeah even this toner i think all the ingredients when coming together is working really well for me and if you're looking for something simpler then go for this one this is blue chamomile face and body mist from raw beauty i don't use this for my body i just use this for my face it just has 100 percent um blue chamomile uh, flower water this is not that hydrating but it feels very soothing and there are days i want simple things for my skin and i find myself you know spraying this on my face a lot and i i hate some of it i also have been liking uh rose water these days but i'd prefer you know blue chamomile over rose water because i find this to be more soothing though rose water is also nice and i also tried their aloe vera hydrozole it didn't do much for my skin to be very honest not gonna buy this again but this one i'd be buying this again for sure because this is simple it does what it's supposed to i have chamomile tea at my place and it smells like those you know, chamomile tea it's very soothing and it's not those you know, artificial scented chamomile it's not it's just pure good chamomile in there and you get the water that's it nothing else if your skin gets like red if you want something to cool it down you can try this one it can work for all skin types if, if you're a teenager you can use it good stuff you also can use this for you know your uptans you can mix your uptan with it all right next i have this body milk from boho botanist this is their rose a uh, rose hip body milk this is so lightweight and there are days i don't want you know heavy body uh, lotions or whatsoever i want something light something hydrating and this is there if you like those body lotions that take uh, time to absorb you're gonna love this because it absorbs just like that very quickly it has this very sugary sweet smell so if you're not into like scented body lotions you're not gonna like it but it works fine for me it absorbs really quickly i've been loving this i also like that dry oil because again summer is coming and we won't want those in you know, a heavy sticky body oils so the dry oil also very nice from this brand but if you have like really really dry skin then i think you need something more moisturizing uh, and it won't work that well for you but if you have like oily skin normal skin a little bit dry skin even i think for summer it can do wonders and this is good all right next i have this one from physio gel this is the ai lotion i have tried their cream before that is thick and this is actually a body lotion but i tried this for my face it works fine and i checked the ingredients and i i was okay with it you know to be used for my face it seems fine it worked fine for me though i tried their lotion for dry skin that gave me white head i don't know why uh, i am not gonna recommend that maybe it can work for you but for me it didn't work 
on my face but this ai lotion it has been working really well for me so if you want something lighter for your skin that has you know uh, this lotion kind of a consistency i think you're gonna love it it works really well under sunscreen it works well under makeup it is fragrance free it has shea butter lecithin it also has qualin sarcosin and it has ceramide np and it feels actually quite soothing on the skin and the brand says it's gonna work on redness if you have reactive skin it can work really well for you it just helps to repair the skin barrier if you want a no nonsense a face lotion i think you're gonna like this one but yeah do a patch taste because there are people who told me shea butter they don't like like their skin doesn't like shea butter so yeah this one contains shea butter so yeah do a patch taste and then i have this face serum from wand this is their multivitamin super hydrating serum i really like it the texture is really hydrating and it has five percent nacinamide it also has kakadu plum as source of vitamin c but i don't know how much vitamin c is actually gonna have the kakadu palm it also has probiotics to take care of skin's microbiome i think this is a very underrated serum you know i don't see uh, much hyped behind it but this is really good if you want everyday glow giving hydrating serum i think you're gonna like it a lot and this is one fragrance free formulation and i think it's gonna work for all skin types i really like the dewy glow it gives to my skin doesn't feel sticky absorbs quickly really loving this it's very similar to uh, this overdermis vitamin b uh, serum and then i have this sun stick from minimalist and this has to be the best sun stick i ever used to be very honest so i've never used too many sun sticks it gives very dewy finish but it is not as dewy as isn't isn't tree sun stick and that were problem for some people but still it doesn't give matte finish uh, but i really like it it feels hydrating it contains new generation sunscreen filters and i think it also contains niacinamide this is fragrance free quite affordable for a sun stick and i mainly use sun stick for reapplication so there it does a good job didn't give me any skin irritation doesn't uh, like peel off very easy to apply and i think if you're new to sun stick game you can give it a try it doesn't sting my eyes as well minimalist also has uh, the sunscreen texting report on their official website it has spf 50 and like i told you it has new generation organic filters which are quite effective uh, in giving protection against uva and uv rays but i'd like to see how it works during like you know peak of summer so yeah if you're looking for a good sun stick you're gonna like it i think but if you're into like mineral based sunscreens then it's not for you it has chemical sunscreen filters and i have tried one mineral based uh, sun stick from CeraVe that didn't work well for me that gave me a very bad white cast and that felt really heavy which i didn't like for me but i'll try to find more mineral sun sticks for you so many people they like uh, mineral filters over organic or chemical filters but i don't mind organic or chemical filters because they feel fine on my skin and they are like cosmetically they're very elegant they're lightweight they leave no white cast so yeah i am okay with it more than fine with it and if you're looking for a good affordable sun stick i think you're gonna love it but for sun stick i use it for reapplication to be very honest otherwise i prefer my same old uh, gel sunscreen lotion sunscreen i think the application is better because with that you know you can miss the patch like you're applying here then by mistake you didn't apply here then you're just applying here so this patch is um unprotected right so you have to be very careful like applying sun stick so you don't miss any patch on your skin so yeah that's there so yeah that's all for now let me know if you have found any new skincare that you liked share your recommendations with me anything that you tried didn't work for you feel free to share here and i'm gonna see you very soon then bye bye